Hi guys, another exciting video from Z-Axis. Like we mentioned in our last one, we're trying to do one of these at least once a week. So if there's something you really want us to make for you, let us know. Today we're just doing a quick review on our leak standards. Whether you have an eye kit or the Isaac, any of our products, you can plug the leak standard into it. So what a leak standard is, is just a calibrated orifice. So when I unscrew this protective, you can see right here. So we have two different styles. This is a crimp style. So say this was supposed to be made at 10 cc's at three PSI, we'd have three PSI supplied to it and we keep crimping this down while it's flowing through our flow meter until we get the exact CC flow rate that you want. The other style is with tubing. So we'll put in an inch or two of calibrated tube length in there and then you cut it down to achieve the flow rate you want. And then the protective tube goes back over it and you're all set. Now we have some people that will do this as a challenge to the tester. Um, if, we, if all the numbers we received and the leak standard was made correctly, you can run a good part, that part will pass, and then if you run that good part again with the leak standard plugged in, you should just barely fail. Now some people will do this once a month, some people do it every six months. It's all up to you when you want to run the challenge of that tester. Um, one good thing to do is if you happen to do this before your shift each morning and for some reason it fails and you do not detect the leak, then worst case scenario, you'd only have one day of parts in jeopardy. Now that could just mean the tester was out of calibration. Uh, maybe the pressure was set wrong. Maybe the intern swapped testers on you last night and you don't even know. But we thought we'd make a little video, let you know about that. And again, any videos you want about different products or maintenance or whatever we can help you with, just let us know. Thanks and have a great day.